Hello, people. It has been a minute since I have came on here and vlogged. But I am vlogging today. And I'm cooking. And I'm on my way downstairs. I'm trying to fix my clothes, y'all. With my tights. Oh, my behind. Okay. Take this downstairs. I was watching the news. Oh, let me take my blanket because I'm going to be down there. And it's cool down there. So. Uh, Audrey is at work and the red is cleaning his room and I think Jacor is asleep. So yeah. Um my fiance <laughs> that's crazy saying that, but um my fiance is on his way home. He probably like, dang, Key, you just um broke up with your ex-husband. How the hell you engaged so fast? Girl, let me see some. Time wait for nobody. You either know what you want or you don't know what you want. And y'all probably like, you probably needed time to heal. You should have took time off. You you need time to, to understand who you are and zen out. No, you need time for that, okay? See, that is the problem. Men... They don't need time to heal a lot of times, a lot of times, not all the time, a lot of times. They'll break up with you and in 10.10 seconds have Sheila at the house banging her back out. So I'm good. <laughs> okay. I'm better than good. I'm the happiest I have been in my whole entire life. Do you understand what I'm saying? So yes, um, it's just a good vibe. Um, I'm making, I have some lasagna in the oven right now. So I got that cooking and um, I'm gonna get ready for some garlic bread in there. So I was gonna wait till it's almost done. Yeah, I feel like my bun is crooked, but I crooked, but I know it's not. But it's, my hair is so big because it's not, it's a lot of hair, but it's not a lot of hair. But because of the passion twist being so big, it's a big old bun. But that's how I'm rocking it right now. I just like this updo look, so I'm rocking it. Um, but y'all can see how it, if you go to my Instagram, you can see how it look when it's just all down. It's very, very pretty. It's just easier for work. This is more professional to have it like this. So that's what we're doing. I was gonna light like this candle, but you can still smell it. You can smell a lasagna. So I'm not gonna light the candle, but I am gonna open this blind a little bit. Just a little. I think I feel like I moved the carpet when I did that. Let me fix it. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, um, like I said, you know, I just been chilling and been enjoying life and trying to just, you know, just maintain a good, healthy life on my terms. I'm finna try to sit y'all up here. Hold on. Okay. There y'all go. Y'all should be good. I need to see who just texted me. I always tell me my steps. Check this lasagna real quick. Yeah, I'm telling y'all like Lindy got a lot of stuff going on. Okay. Lasagna is almost done. What time is it? It's 5.40. I'm gonna see if it's, I should cook it a little more. Let me see. That looks really good. And I think I can go ahead and start putting the garlic bread in. So that is what I'm gonna do. Oh, y'all, these Italian ices are so freaking good. And they so soft. They do not, they do not get hard. So I need, uh, I need a pan. I don't want to use that one. But it looked like I'm going to have to use that one. Because I don't think this pan is big enough. Let's see. I'm going to sit y'all right here right quick. Oh, yes. Okay. You didn't rinse that off because it's clean and it came out of dishwasher. 
So, don't come for me. Yeah, I'm trying to lose weight. I had lost weight, but I gained my tummy back. Um, but I am working out. So, y'all got to bear with me. Oh, yeah. This, I, it is a such thing as happy weight. Because it's like, when I was miserable and sad, I lost tons of weight. And now I'm being happy. I am gaining that happy weight. Like, it's crazy. So, um, I have started working out. Trying to keep my body right. <sighs> it's hard. Because I'm a snacker. I like to snack. So, this is hard to do. It's not being like it's a snack. Like I normally do. So. Oh, and a lot of y'all have... I already met my fiance. If you watched my, hold on. If you watched my um, try on hauls from Shein and Walmart and stuff, you pretty much already met him. So it's not a surprise or a secret. Oh yeah, it's cold in my house. I keep my air on 70 so it can stay cool because it's so hot outside. I don't never want to have to, um, come in and be in no hot house. So I keep the air on 70. But these kids been touching my air and putting it on 68. And it's been having my house like freezing. So I'm gonna have to do something different So I think I'm gonna go to, um, I've been saying I'm gonna go to uh, Home Depot or Lowe's and get one of those um, boxes that you put around the AC unit. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. <sighs> yeah, not doing anything. Need to find something to watch. Oh, uh, I can watch the news. The news is on. Me and baby normally watch the news together, but he's not here. Um, I do have to. Um, I mean, we might. You know what? We might play Connect Four tonight. We haven't played um, Connect Four in a while. We've been playing Uno. So he finally beat me in Uno after a couple of games. And everybody know I'm the queen of Uno, and I'm the queen of Connect Four. So. I think we might do a game of Connect Four today. And then tomorrow I'm going out with the girls um, just to have a little break. Um, Cause I've been a mama, I've been a fiance. I've, I've been a lot of things to a lot of people. I've been a therapist and all kinds of stuff and I'm just tired. So I want to take some little time for me. And you know what? I need to get back in my skincare routine. Cause I feel like that thing is not necessarily getting bigger but I don't know. It just um. Well, I'm gonna probably try to go see my dermatologist because it's irritating me again. So, but I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start my uh skincare regimen back tonight on um, taking care of my skin and stuff and trying to get it to go down. And I might need to up my. I might have to get back on a lot of my medication. I did start my uh metformin again, just because. I have come to times that I am pre-diabetic, if not diabetic, and I need to take better care of myself if I plan on being around for my family. So, I'm not in denial no more. I'm doing what I need to do, um, and that's it. That. Um, what else, y'all? What else been going on? Because y'all, like, y'all never give us no update. Y'all, nothing really. I haven't really been doing anything. I've just been enjoying. I don't know what the hell that is. I have just been enjoying being 40, being in love, and just living my life. And yes, my fiance is here, okay? Um, that was a decision that we made. And that's what we're sticking to. What, son? Can I get the swimmer? Yeah. Where's it? Oh, no, I don't know. Oh, it's right here. Oh, okay. It's not in my room, I know that. Come check this garage. But, um, what else I want to tell y'all? Hold on. They talking about sending the child. I don't know if y'all got y'all child tax credits today, but I did, honey. And I put that on the bill because. Um, I have to go get their sh Well, they school clothes gonna always be taken care of. And I, it's a child tax credit. And you like, it's for the kids. Okay, this cable, that's for the kids. Their car insurance, 
without the car insurance, they can't get in that car. That's for the kids. But I have to go get their um, school clothes. No, I gotta get the school shirts Saturday. I have an appointment at the store at 9 30. Not telling y'all what store it is. Well, by the time y'all see this, it won't even matter. And I have to order Audrey's shoes online this week so they can be here before school starts. Jacor is getting little red shoes. I have the best son in the world. You know, he worked my nerves. He's an amazing child. Um, and I have to go get their pants, their school pants. Um, and their school pants are probably gonna come from Kohl's. And then I have to get their school supplies and then I'm done. Both of them are in high school this year. This is Idris last year. Oh, which reminds me, probably next Friday, I need to go talk to my tailor about making Idris prom dress and see how much she's gonna charge me for my for Idris prom dress so I can put down the deposit for her dress. Um, what else I need to do? I need to book a photographer for Audrey's senior pictures. I need to go and get her senior pictures out the way. Um, because she can wear my little cap and gown. Uh, and then my, my nephew, my uh, little cousin, he got a cap and gown from last year. She can slide that on for her senior pictures as well. Um, what else I need to do? We're not doing a senior party. Uh, we're going to do a dinner somewhere. She wants to do a dinner, so we're going to do a dinner. Um, with family and friends and my her main focus is she wants a Miami trip and dang they knows it she wants a Miami trip and she wants a um car so the deal is whatever she saved in her savings account I match that with her to get her help her get her car her Miami trip y'all y'all know doggone well I was not gonna allow my child to go Miami on her first trip at 18 and no parental supervision. <laughs> so there I will be going to Miami with her just because I've went already and I've experienced it. And I'm not gonna be in a mix or nothing because it's a group of her a group of her and her friends going. I'm not gonna be in a mix or nothing. But I am gonna be down there. Up here, I just feel like for her first trip, a parent needs to be down there. So if they need me, they could call and say, Hey, sweet and I'm there. I'm already in Miami, so it's not gonna take me nothing to get to them. So yeah, that's how we doing that. And they might change their mind. I mean, they might decide they don't want to go to Miami. But right now, her thing is Miami. So, that's what we doing with that. What else I got going on? That's pretty much it, y'all. I haven't been doing anything. Oh, I start back school um, in August. I'm going, uh, yeah, I'm getting my associates in uh, human resources. So, yeah, I, I just got a lot on my plate. Um, I'm trying to focus on my daughter's senior year. Loretta starts his first year of high school this year. <sighs> Ja'Cory is getting ready to take his driver's test actually t Wednesday. Yeah. No, Tuesday. Tuesday he's getting ready to take his driver's test. Um, you know, he's not working at Waterburger no more. He's at Walmart. Um, life has just been good. Like, we've been hit with a few things, but for the most part, life has been really, really good, and I haven't been stressed. I haven't been losing my mind. Like, for one minute, my edges was gone, honey. I did not have no edges. Do you understand me? My my edges and everything. My hair was breaking off all around the perimeter, because that's how bad I was stressing. And I'm not stressing. I'm on my hair just growing back, just growing back, just growing back. And, huh, y'all, when you get stressed out your life and eliminate stress and toxic people out your life, the peace that you feel is amazing. I am surrounded by so much love from people that it's not even funny. Um, I'm just surrounded by love. I'm surrounded by love and I'm surrounded by peace. Um, I have you know went through a couple of things um with family my immediate family but for the most part i am okay with life i am learning to um love on those who love me and be around those that want to be around me and surround myself around those that want to be surrounded by me and that's what i've been doing i'm not 
I don't care if you family or friends, I'm not forcing you in my life and I'm not going to tolerate disrespect in my life when it comes to people. So when I feel like I'm disrespected or I feel like you're not respecting me as a person, not just your family, as your person, as a person, I'll remove you from my space in order to keep my peace. And that don't, I don't care who it is. That's just, that's just been my thing as of lately. Um, so yes, guys. I just I've been I've been chilling and I'm going to start picking up the camera more now that my um, life is back normal not saying that it was chaotic because it wasn't chaotic but it was I had so much going on and I was bouncing off the walls I was moving here and there and everywhere like I was just every everywhere and I was everything to everybody and I had no time to pick up a camera um, the little times that y'all did see me pick up the camera, those try on haul video things and a couple of vlogs that I did do, that was a job within itself. And I don't want YouTube, YouTube is my outlet place. I don't want it to feel like a job. So I'm finally at a place where it doesn't feel like a job and I'm back picking up the camera with you guys, back talking to you guys. And I hope you guys, um, welcome me back with open arms. So. I'm finna get out of here because I need to finish this food before um, babe get to the house. Um, Y'all just heard Loretz. He's up, like I said, he's upstairs cleaning his room and I just at work. But I need to go on and finish that before he get here because he said he's hungry. So I will see you guys in the next vlog. Remember to think smart, live smarter, and have no. Oh my God, that's sad. I have not vlogged in so long. I don't know my stuff. Remember to think, spend smart, spend smart, no, think smart, spend smarter, and have fun planning it all out. Or is it spend smart, think smarter, and have fun planning it all out? Look, let me tell you something. We're going to do a new one because that's just too much. Live your life because you only got one life to live. Period. All right, I'll see you guys in the next vlog. I am Keys Playing Life, and I thank you guys for tuning in. Bye.